Clark goes to visit Dr. Swan, finds him in the back room of the planetarium. So uh, this might be a good point for me to kind of fill the audience in. So we we filmed 95% of this episode with James in Vancouver. And then Greg Beeman and I, and we've talked about Greg Beeman a lot. Him and I jumped on flights over the weekend and we flew out to New York City to work with Christopher Reeve to, um, to film this. And the quick story is the idea was we were going to film Chris talking to me and then he was going to be allowed or to go. Right. He wasn't going to stay there for my, my coverage, which if anybody make, you know, two actors talk to each other, sometimes one actor leaves and the other one stays. It doesn't happen. Anyway, Chris wouldn't leave. And I think it was six or seven hours later that his nurse said to him, if you're, because she kept saying, you got to leave. It's time for us to leave because they, you know, it's dangerous. It's that, dangerous for him. And she, I remember her saying, if you don't leave, I'm calling the police. It's amazing. And you know, it's funny. I've heard this story 10 times and it still sounds like the first time because it's, 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 yeah. it's who he was. You know, he just wanted to give it all. He wanted to put it all out there. Well, can you, can you imagine being him? He's Superman. He's Superman to me. He always will be. Me too. For him to give us that credit, you know, his credit to be a part of our show, it's, it's legendary. I mean, it's, it's just, I, when I'm watching this episode, I'm just, my heart drops. So, yeah. hey guys, this is Dan from Illinois. Tom, you were really the only actor that not only got to work with Christopher Reeve, but also pretty much got his endorsement to carry the legacy forward. As a person, what does that mean to you? Keep up the great work. Always hold on to Smallville, guys. Love you. I mean, it's, it's. It was astounding. He he said to me, "I'm glad you're the next Superman." And I said to him, "Well, I'm not. I'm I'm playing Clark Kent." And he said to me, "Well, you should be." And I still get chills, and I got chills at the moment. Him and I, I don't know. Him and I got along. Even if you see that that thing we did for the announcement, me sort of razzing him a little bit. You know, him. We just had the same stupid sense of humor like you and I have. You know what I mean? Like yeah. it was just fun. He was just great. 